Okay, so this is going to be one of those really weird vlog video things. I don't know how this is going to turn out. But Dana mentioned in a live show recently that she likes days in the lives and resets. I'm in the mood right now to purge some of this um mon Strusity in here and on the cart and get rid of a few things because I want this book out of my house, out of my life, out of my viewpoint, out of everything I can see. So I'm doing some unhauls. Now, any book I show that I'm getting rid of in this, there is no attack on anybody's books. Nobody's attacks on anything. Also, if you can hear anything outside, the window's open because it feels amazing outside. So we turned off the air conditioner and has all the windows open in the house. And I have my fan on to blow the air in because it's starting to get no longer air. But that being said, because I want that book out of here, I've already got, I went through the shelves for the first time and was kind of realistic with myself. I'm not going to get to bite risk. My friends said it was meh. I've attempted. Got halfway through and was kind of bored. If I ever want to read this, I'm going to listen to it. And if I ever want to read this, I'll listen to it. It was a gift from someone that I'm no longer friends with. It just came off of her shelves. So. Megan Brandy used to be here. Megan Brandy is now there. If you see my Alice Oseman collection, something is missing. I've decided, because I'm going to be realistic until we move, the British covers of the non Heartstopper books. Yeah, a couple of them have Heartstopper characters. And the original cover of Radio Silence, I don't need. So, this version of Loveless, I was born for this, Radio Silence, Solitaire, This Winter, and Nick and Charlie can all go. If you look, I'm going to bring you a little closer. It looks a lot more streamlined, and I only need a lot of editions of the Heartstopper series, and I prefer the American. Ooh. I prefer the American hardbacks because they're drawn by Alice Osman. Granted, do I have two editions of Solitaire because the flames and stuff look different? Yes, I do. my Megan Brandies because the box can move and I can put more Megan Brandies. I'm planning on getting more of her stuff. So, there's that. This is probably the worst. Oh, fuck. Sorry, Chewy. That chair was not supposed to do that. I'm sorry, Chewy. Chewy Chew was underneath the chair and it tilted. It's probably the worst angle imaginable because I look preggers right here. Let me come down so we can talk. Okay. I'm just going to break this down real fast. So what I'm doing now is I'm trying to figure out what's going to take Megan's old spot. And because I like filming sitting in this chair now, eventually I'm going to get a better chair. But Again, I don't know what this video is going to be all about, so I'm going to clean up a little bit of this back here. I think some of this may move up there and some of these may get moved around. I am tempted to bring Alice and Megan down to here 
because they'll be seen in the video. Or bring them down here and bring this all down one. I don't know. This shelf is a jumble of a mess. It's just gonna have to deal because it's all my TJ clones. And I'm gonna have four more Green Creeks going up there, plus eight more paperbacks when we get to them being released. These are gonna have to go like this eventually, which I may go ahead and start doing that. But if I can get some of the books over here or there unhauled out of the way, because I am buying new books coming soon for book clubs. If I can get a shelf over there in the corner for my next rounds of uh, Ba and Fiction Falls book clubs, I will. So again, I don't know what this video is going to be, but let me know if you like this. Also, I can't send anybody any of these books. Um, they're already going to be gone. Because if I can get a decent, like, unhaul over here coming, I'll go ahead and take them. What are you doing, Chewy? Chewie's also, look, when I asked Chewie what he's doing, he also looked at me and said, what the hell are you doing? I just figured an unhaul day in the life reorganization of cleaning these shelves and making them look more presentable, at least. We shall see what happens. And then I'll want y'all's opinions. I'm leaving the chair here. The bottom two shelves are not getting touched. I wish I had somewhere else in the house to put stuff like that. Hopefully one day when we move, we'll have plenty of space and I can have my library back. I ain't taking you in there, guys. It's we're using it as a spare bedroom because we have a friend that comes over. Tate, who comes over and visits all the time and hangs out with us, who will probably become our next roommate. After we get a bigger enough place, we like the idea of having a roommate. It makes bills easier. And easier to buy a house. So, I'm going to move some things around. And I'm going to go ahead and apologize for the sounds outside. And, uh, and for any of the angles look bad because they're going to look bad. Because self-conscious bitch here. I'm a hot mess. This is the hot mess express of a re revamp, clearing, moving some things around. Let's just see what this video becomes. It's probably not even going to get posted. No, it'll get posted for Dana and Dana only. So, Dana, I hope you like this. You like Day in the Lives and stuff like this, so... I was already doing this, so I just went... Might as well film. This is a relaxing day in the life of Ant <laughs> Smut Bear. I did just film my October wrap-up. I've already put those books away to where they need to go, but I have some that have no homes, so let us try and I'll try to get something here first, and then we can work on this down here. So 
So I'm gonna stop the video here so I can start a new spot so that I can possibly just speed up whatever this is.
I just realized. You probably saw none of that. Actually, I like how that looks. I don't like the fact that my fake boyfriend is here. So we got Suspense, going into Regular MM, into Paranormal MM. With Red, White, and Royal Blue. Right here, Song of Achilles, and... So this will be the five behind me. Oh my god, I like this vibe. Don't y'all? I'm gonna pause, I'm gonna finish up some stuff, move some things, and then I'll give y'all a final view. Okay, so now I need to do... Look at these. I need to figure out what I can put there now that those are over there. Um... None of that has to move. Um, what's missing from that is over there on my cart. Ignore the fan. So I'm gonna lay up. And now I have practically an empty spot. I can put that down and put all of these loose books in here. Ah! Oh my god. But I do need to go through these again and be realistic. Not for sure if I want to get rid of my Freedom and Fatons yet. I just need to be realistic. So, okay. I realized the fan was right here, so I turned it off. But now I have like a fantasy shelf. And then I threw in some leftovers, because now the bottom, what I needed off, can be removed, and book club books can go over there, so I have a spot. I did get rid of... I'm going to get rid of the Charmed Friends of Trove Isle and the Library of Borrowed Hearts, because they're more literary and chiclety. So I feel like I need to, um, you know, <laughs> I need to be realistic with myself. So we're going to start up here with the heart stoppers going into the rest of the Alice to all my Megan Brandy, which still leaves room. If I move the box back here, I could put more Megan's. Two, this is the miscellaneous kind of shelf. To Serena and L, which L Kennedy and Serena Bowen. Right here is Stay and Top Secret. To this, the Madeline Miller, Casey McQuiston, and my Adriana Mather, James Bird, and Kit Vincent. My TJ clones, which I still need to work on this mess right here. I think I'm going to go ahead and flip them here in a minute and see what that looks like. And then there's those. Then you've got Max Walker. And then my Josh Lyon. Or Lanyon. To my Memento Mori. Um, domestic partners to the rest of my Mel Mel mystery that I own. Oh, I knocked over Braveheart Lion. Two fake boyfriends going into the um, Levin O'Leary series. My Alpha Sun series into the Soulbound series. Now, what you're going to see behind me is probably going to be this viewpoint 
with my head being like right here, body and head, but that, ugh, all the Mel Mel behind me, ugh. And over here, I did put in just a few more of the Mel Mel's from over there. But yeah, part of the mass, but yeah, the book club books can now go on the bottom of the cart. Yay! Ignore the hocus pocus and down. I'm loving how this is looking. Uh, the Clint's Library is the first gift Sterling ever gave me, so that's why it's still there. It will probably, in the new place, go over my desk. So I don't know what kind of video this turned out to be, or if anybody even likes this kind of thing. Also, it decided to just start pouring. Um, but yeah, I had fun revamping and I felt like it needed. I still feel like there's some other books that I could be getting rid of, but who knows? I think that is a good chunk to take to half price, just to get rid of some books. Um,. So yeah, Dana, I hope you like this, because I heard you like... Oh, I don't know. Have y'all ever seen the wall right there? Do y'all like my wall of inspiration? I love that wall. <sighs> I mean, y'all have seen his wall. I can't show one of those pictures. I'll get demonetized. Kind of wish that my desk did not face his wall. Kind of wish I could sit back there. But I'm working on getting something that I'm that might make it where I can put my laptop back there and have it facing at least a blank wall. But but yeah, this is it's lots of fun. Um, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up. If not, let me know in the bottom if you don't like these kind of videos. Or if y'all have any suggestions on how to, like, revamp how I did this. This is just going to be called a chaotic revamping, restocking, recleaning vlog. Day in the life. No, I might just call it Day in the Life of a Chaotic Mess. Well, it's not really a full day, so... A moment in time of a chaotic OCD cleanse. Don't ask. But, I hope you guys like this. So, hit that thumbs up, hit that like, comment down below. If something you think doesn't look nice. Maybe I should, like, move, like, one book over or something. Let me know. Right now, my OCD is really enjoying how it's looking. Which is saying something. I wanted to, like, revamp and give Megan Brandy some more room. That was my main thought process. And I was like, might as well get rid of the Alice Osmonds that I don't particularly care for those covers. I just don't really go with it. Good God. Good God, guys. Sky opened up and failed. Oh, well, like I was saying, I hope you guys have a wonderful night and um, embrace your inner rainbow. Take care of your mental health. Be kind to one another. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.